What we have here today is Dell's latest micro PC, Dell Optiplex Micro 7020. Traditionally, Dell used to release three models each year, but since last year, they simplified it with just two models, base model and the plus model. We intended to review both, but all of our plus models are now sold due to pricing them well below the market price like most of our products. Since we have tested it anyway, we will include that in the discussion. Compared to the predecessor Optiplex 7010, the back of the machine remains virtually unchanged. They still take same 65 or 90 watt power supply, which we sell by the way. With the base model, you get one HDMI and one display port. Sadly, HDMI is limited to 1920 by 1200 p resolution at 60 Hz maximum. Four higher resolution display output. DisplayPort supports up to 4K, but capped at 60 Hz or 1080p at 120 Hz. Moving on to the USBs, configurations are also the same as the older model. The ones with blue insert are USB 3.2 Gen 1. They offer 5 gigabits per second max transfer speed. Right next to them are two old USB 2.0. You can differentiate them with their black inserts. Do not make a mistake of connecting any external storage device to these. They are painfully slow. For the networking, you have typical one gigabit per second ethernet. For wireless Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connectivity, these can be configured as such. Our model has Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. We can tell from this protruding antenna. If your model has flat corner, then yours does not have Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. But don't worry too much because we sell built-in wireless kit. Check our website or eBay store or simply just WhatsApp us. While the back was exactly the same as last year, the front is where we have one nice upgrade. Unlike last model, there is now an USB Type-C port. They never included USB-C to the base models. It is still USB 3.2 Gen 2 with 10 gigabits per second max transfer speed. If you opt for the Plus model, you will lose the HDMI, but you will have three display ports. Also, the power adapter is Big Barrel 180 Watt. Plus model does lose one USB from the back, but all USBs are faster than base models. At the back, you'll find one 5 gigabits per second USB and two 10 gigabits per second USB. USB-C is also twice as fast with 20 gigabits per second ratings. In the next video, we will take a look inside these devices. We will discuss the SSD slots, RAM configurations, and most importantly, the processor configuration. There are three surprise upgrades that you will be glad to discover. If the video is ready, link will be in the comment section.